guys welcome back to my channel I'm very close up today um and that's because um if you watched my last last one of my videos previously um you know that I tried a new skincare product and it didn't go out turn out so well I had a big red puffy face it was such dry skin everywhere my skin freaked out um but it was kind of a blessing i think because i think i learned how i should be taking care of my skin i've been using scrubs on my face for a really long time like like um facial cleansing scrubs like the stuff with the beads and everything because i always loved the feeling of just like scraping away the dirt and I always felt like if I used just like a regular foaming cleanser it wasn't getting everything off like I needed something to scrape it off like all the stuff off and I'm thinking now that that's not the case um, because when I was letting my skin heal from the Neutrogena incident I was not thinking so much about like washing my face again like I didn't want to put anything on my face because even just taking a shower with that water on my face was making it burn so I was like I don't want to wash my face with anything at all so I wasn't I was still putting makeup on in the process of trying to get my skin to heal so what I would do is just use uh, cleansing cloths and then put on lotion afterwards um and luckily to my uh, boyfriend he gave me a cream that he used to use on his face and it is this guy right here it this is the Aveeno positively radiant intensive night cream I don't think I've used a better product in my life um, I used to get a subscription to BoxyCharm. I think I mentioned that in one of my videos, but I did unsubscribe because um, I'm just not uh, financially stable for that right now. I can use that money elsewhere right now, so I unsubscribed. Um, but I got loads of high-end like creams like night creams and moisturizing creams to put on your face and they didn't really do much for me and I think it was because I was using such a harsh scraping product on my skin and my skin is super sensitive that I've just learned obviously um so I've only been for like the past two weeks now using makeup wipes and this guy that's it for cleaning my face that is it um, I'm definitely just like rinsing my face in the shower. I'm taking the water, splashing it in my face, working the water through my face and down my neck. Um, and whatever soap I have on my hands, I just do like a quick once over and quickly get it off because I'm so nervous now that my skin is so sensitive. So I want to show you uh, the holy grails. Um, of my life right now. So this guy, I'll show you him right here. Let me get out of the way. The Avino Intensive Night Cream. This stuff is thick. It's like thick, but not. You know what I mean? It's really good though. And it's definitely like and it smells clean like it just has that clean scent um and then i'm pairing that with these guys to take off the day the ultra calming um cleansing makeup wipes that way it, there's no like harsh chemicals in it this says it has the ultra calming makeup removing wipes gently soothes and cleanses removing dirt and makeup and even mascara so today obviously i went to work focus on me please come on focus okay so obviously i went to work today it's monday uh 
I did a full face. I have contour on. That's why I'm sitting like this, because I want to get up nice and close so you guys can see. Makeup still looks pretty good for being on for over 12 hours. Um, so what we're going to do is I'm going to take it off. And I'm going to show you guys what I'm basically doing. Um, for my nightly nightly skincare routine, I guess you could call this. Um, so yeah, here we go. And these towelettes are, oh, they're just so nice. Like they're so soft. Oh, they just feel great. Okay, here we go. I'm just gonna remove all this stuff. Yeah, I say that worked. Now, I don't have a real specific way of doing this. I just go in and take it all off. I use quite a bit of these just because I do. I tend to try to do my eyes last because they're a pain in the neck. But That's one towelette now. I go through these. Stupid fast. Stupid fast. Get it off our neck. So I put a lot of crap on my neck. And even on my chest, actually, you could say. Look at all that. Um, but yeah. So, so far, my skin has healed so nicely with these products. Like, Avino, you saved my life from... Neutrogena, I appreciate you. Um, and you know, I even read after a while reviews on that stuff. And it seems that a lot of people had the same issue as me. I even found a few videos on it. Um, but you know what? I feel like people are more afraid to make a video that's negative about a product than a positive one. Um, but I don't want to just sell you guys on something that didn't work because it was horrible. That shit was horrible. Yes, my eyes get very red when I do this. Um, but it was so bad, that stuff. You don't understand how bad that stuff was. Um... I just, I couldn't believe it. That was the worst my face has ever been. And I went on Accutane before my life. And if you don't know what Accutane is, it's a pill you can take for your acne. Um, if creams and things don't work, it's prescribed by a dermatologist. Um, but, so I've been on that before. And that completely dries out your skin because what it does is it... I think I'm missing spots. Is it um, dries out your um, the glands that secrete oils in your skin, so you don't have so much acne. That's the point. So you don't get as much oil, which means your face gets super dry. I was putting on chapstick like crazy, and. I've been using the Neutrogena product blew that shit out of the water. Like, I wasn't even as dry on a prescription medication that's supposed to make your skin dry. I wasn't even that dry. And, uh, and not as dry as this product, what this product did to me. So, yeah. We're almost done. I like to go over a few few times, especially around the nose area, okay. I tend to really dig in there. But these are just so soft and nice on the skin. I do have a lot of redness, but I'm a pale, pale, pale girl with thin, thin skin, so that's bound to happen but overnight 
you wouldn't even think like you would think I had work done. That's how good this stuff works. So let's see up close. Oh, makeup's basically off. Good. All right. And now I'm gonna put on the cream. Make sure this is all off. Oh, it's just so, like my skin looks red, yes, but it's so smooth, which is what I want. Because the night cream, that's the thing, is that this night cream, intensive night cream, total soy complex. Smooth the night cream over face and neck to reduce the look of dark spots, uneven tone and texture. That's the thing, like in here, I have a, so many uneven tones and textures. Um, so yeah, and the redness here and the redness here, like I have a lot of redness. So this really helps with that. So I'm just going to go in with a clean hand, clean fingers. I'm going to do a decent swipe because I'm pretty dry. I'm going to put all this on my face. Dry really quickly because it's still a little bit wet. Oh, it just smells so good. I feel so clean after doing this. It's just so nice. We're just gonna work this in with our fingertips. And I try to keep my hands pretty cool, like cold. Um, not so much hot because I feel that the hotter I, use with products like washing your face you use hot water i tend to get a little bit more swollen i mean i'm putting this shit in my eyelids it's just just good it works so well i'm gonna put some down here under here and you know you can apply this like more than once during the night i i don't even consider it a night cream i'm just using it as my daily moisturizer right now um, but it's just so calming, like, it's so smooth, so, so smooth, um, but yeah, that is my night routine right now for my skin and everything that's been happening to it lately. Coming close. It doesn't even give you, like, that oily finish. So it's pretty, pretty good. I really, really, really like this product. It's so, so nice. I'm gonna track my progress with like the tone and everything. So this is where I'm at now. I was a lot worse before, like with redness, it was like super red right here. Um, but after using this product for like a week, it's just like kind of pink in here. Like it's not really red. It's a little bit red here, but like it used to be like red, 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 red here. Um, and so I'm going to track this. I'm going to try to do like a update in like a vlog style video without any makeup on during the weekend, um, to see where we're at with that. But, um, yeah, this shit is really really good. I am loving these things right now. Um, I know this guy right here retails for about, I think it's $13.99 for this thing, but it works really well. These are $7.99, um, but together they're fabulous. They're just so good. They're so good. Um, so yeah, these are the products. I'm gonna link both down below in the description. If you're having the same trouble as me, give these guys a try because they seriously work so, so well. I feel like you can already see that the redness is going away. Like legit, you can already see it. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little nighttime routine that I have going on for dry, fair skin. Um, so yeah. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Please subscribe and turn on notifications to be notified for when I post videos. And I'll see you guys in my next one.